Hi, I'm Ryan Nickel, CTO at DSA Ocean, and today I want to talk about calculating ship response amplitude operators using the generic frigate uh, sample project as an example. So we've already gone through the process of setting up the numerical uh, generic frigate ship model, and now we want to calculate some kind of idea of what the RAO is and get an idea of the ship motion response. So that's where we go to add existing data and see keep regular. Keep regular means regular ocean waves, so that's what's used in the RAO calculation process. Now, ship motion database file name, this is what we've computed and set up in build chip. So we'll go open this file, make sure you want to make sure that file pass pointing to your project folder. Um, there's lots of different options for uh, uh, printing out different information um, in the output files. We're just going to leave everything at default. Um, as well as the uh, C directions and speed ranges. This does not take a long time to compute. So uh, you can just go through and, and, uh, and leave everything default and not worry too much about it. Now, sea keeping positions are uh, the name for data points that you add to the ship that spit out some additional information on acceleration and displacement. And we'll see an example of that uh, later. Uh, optionally, you can uh, create a Proteus DS compatible format for the motion RAO. We'll just, let's just do that for now. So go save and run. And that's it. So it's gone through quite a number of forward speeds and relative C directions. So we'll plot the RAOs. And out of this interface here, you can pick the different combinations of forward speeds. So we've got zero forward speed right now, surge, sway, heave, roll, pitch, and yaw RAOs, as well as the rudder response. And a good one to always check is the beam loading condition. So you can see the roll RAO here has got a nicely defined peak. And if you left click, you can just see some of the specific data points along here. And of course, some variations happen with, uh, with forward speed there as well. Uh, and you can see a lot more detailed information in uh, view output. Now, this is showing, is this just a text file? Um, the the, the ckeep regular 4out file is something you can post process directly. Uh, there's lots of information here on the uh, specific RAO numbers. Um, and it can be quite a big file when you've got a lot of information in there. Um, You can see uh, motions at sea keeping positions in regular waves. Uh, so the sea keeping position, remember we picked that location on the ship and we get all kinds of information about uh, the motion at that location. There's lots of information to go through in the, in the output files. Uh, so, uh, but this is usually the first stop at evaluating ship motions is evaluating the, the response amplitude operator. Thanks for watching.